guys, today I am here having a sit down Q&A conversation with my mom. Mom, say hi to the people. Hi, hello everyone out there. Hey, so everyone knows this lady's been all up and down my channel for the past six months to a year. We've been doing a whole bunch of different keto adventures together. Yes, so yes. I wanted to sit down and kind of ask her some questions about her keto journey and keto experience. Mom, are you ready? I am ready. Awesome. Okay. So question number one, what made you want to start the keto diet? Honestly, I saw how successful you were at it. We've been battling our weight all our lives. You're right. You and I have. I mean, I've counted calories. Mm -hmm. I've counted points. Mm -hmm. I've counted sheep. <laughs> I, mean, I've, I mean, and then that this thing worked for me because I saw the results, I saw your results, and then you can eat real food. I mean, you really could eat real food of all kinds, and so I felt that I was more able to like stick to it or be able to do it, and I found success with it. Wow, that is crazy, because it kind of leads right into my second question of what makes the keto diet different from other diets that you tried in the past, which I think you kind of just mentioned. You get right. to eat real food. Real, real food, and you don't feel restricted. I mean, I honestly- like, So you really think that not eating carbs and sugar, you still feel not restricted? Because I feel like that's one of the first things that people say when you tell them that you're following a low to no carb diet, oh, I can never do that. No bread, no pasta, no rice. Like, what do you even eat? And I'm just like, but first of all, there's so many options out there. At first, I thought about that too, but there are so many options. And, and if we don't eat those things, so what? So what? There are Ooh, so many. That's a word right so there. So many other things that wonderful, delicious things that are out there that we can eat. In today's society, when you are inundated with science projects, exactly. they're not even food, exactly. you know? And, and they are chemically true. engineered, delicious tasting science projects. Exactly. You know? Chocolate flavored things. Things, exactly. <laughs> Ice cream dessert. Is right? What? Chocolate flavored chocolate. So, I know. Like, chocolate candy. Variety. Chocolate candy. What? No, it's chocolate, you know? But that's the thing, it's not. They intentionally pump sugar, pump these delicious chemicals into things. Delicious. And so, the fact that we're able to go through life recognizing, yes. geez, those things taste delicious, but they are not good for me, they are not good for my body, they're not good for my everyday life, so I'm choosing to refrain. That just takes a lot of strength that most people just don't have. You know, our family, we have a family history of diabetes. Mm -hmm. And this diet helps so much with that. It does. Not even realizing that, hey, this is helping me health-wise, not only losing weight, but as how my body functions and breaks things down. Exactly. So it's, it's like a twofer. Exactly. And I think... I think that's also what been one of the biggest differences in the keto diet for me as well. Because when you're doing a diet like Weight Watchers, like Jenny Craig, like, you know, just calorie counting. Like you guys, I've been counting calories for over a decade at this point. And I will tell you at one point, my entire 1500 calorie diet consisted of lean cuisines, 100 calorie packs, yes. you know, like not yes. even food. You know? How many skinny cows have you had in your life? Exactly, right? So it's not just about the, the calorie restricting weight loss part of it. It's actually appreciating health Correct. in your body, you Correct. know? Number three, what? issues do you think people and or women specifically over 50 face when trying to lose weight? Metabolism. You know, people say as you get older, your metabolism slows. Now for me personally, myself, the thyroid issue, I had to have mine removed. Mm -hmm. I was having problems with that. So it's just like metabolism. We don't burn calories mm -hmm. as easily. And I, I do think uh, something that you alluded to, it's just like health issues in general. Maybe by the time you get to 50 something, maybe your thyroid's out, maybe your gallbladder's right. out, maybe you had to have something else removed, I you know. I did. <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, so, you know, I think there are specific challenges mostly dealing with metabolism. Correct. But the good thing about that is there are things you can do to combat that, you know? There are things you can do the way that you eat, exercising and building muscle, you know? Definitely. Like, if you weigh less, your bones ain't gotta be carrying correct. as much, you know? Like, it affects the overall oh, health right. of your body. That so, yeah, losing weight and being at a healthy weight is just overall optimal for health in general. Exactly. Okay, so another question, shifting the topic a little bit. Uh, question number four, 
What has been your favorite part of the Watch Autumn Keto journey so far? Honestly, it's just to see it grow, uh, how it has, and then like her subscribers. Guys, you all are amazing. You know, I read all the comments. Sometimes I comment on some of them and I just crack up laughing. And me personally, I love how you all love my daughter. I mean, I really do. I just think it's just awesome because I think she's amazing. And it's just to see that you all really, you know, really value her in, in her opinion and that she would lead you all in a good way. I, that's, that's really, it is. And being a part of it, it's really awesome. Oh, that is great. Thank you so much. And to piggyback off that, like you guys are my world. Like you are my life and I words cannot express how grateful I am that you tune in and that we're able to go on this journey together because that, you know, that was my number one goal in starting this channel uh, is, is showing people that if I can do it, you can do it because I know what it feels like to feel helpless. Okay. I know exactly what it feels like to just be sitting there crying over a tub of ice cream because you don't want to be eating it. You wish you were the type of person that could resist it, but you've you've yeah. given over that you're just not and that this is your life now, exactly. you know? I mean, I've had a weight problem. I am, I'll be 54 this year, guys. Woo -woo. I'll be 54 this year and I've literally struggled with my weight basically my entire life. What two things do you need to lose weight? Discipline, consistency. That's it. That's it, that you guys. Is so That's true. it. I mean, and and once you make up your mind, once you just shift your focus, it all changes. But that's the thing about keto. It makes it easier. Right. It's right. like, you know, it would be difficult if I had to survive off of chicken breast and steamed broccoli, you know? But if I made up my mind to that's what I was going to do, mm -hmm. I could do it. But like now it kind of feels like I'm cheating because I'm like, wait a minute, I get to eat these eggs and this cheese right. and this steak and this bacon? I like I, I get to eat this and I'm still reaching my goals, you know? So the keto diet makes it easy it does. It really to, does. To, to reach your goals, but at the end of the day, you still have to be responsible for your own goals. Okay. Now, the final question, notably the most important question of the night, how was the wing sauce from Aldi? You guys, if you don't remember, uh, we went to Aldi a couple of months ago and we picked our top five favorite keto finds and my mom was obsessed with the wing sauce and I'm like, do you even eat wings? And what was your response? I eat wing sauce. Apparently there's a difference, ladies and gentlemen. How was said wing sauce? Absolutely scrumptious. Remember I said bunless burger, the texture, it had like pieces of no i'm not buying it no i'm not buying it oh man it was just tasty and the garlic and the flavor i'm done Woo! that well so the verdict is in you guys she thoroughly enjoyed oh, man, it was the wing sauce so you guys do you have a question for my mom we all know she is a hoot and i would love to do another one of these videos based on your questions and your responses so Feel free to leave those in the comments and we'll circle back around. And watch Mama Keto. And watch Mama Keto. <laughs> I know, I was like, that is actually brilliant. I know, that was whoever, whoever made that up, bring, put that in the comments. Right. We appreciate you so oh, much. Yes. Um, but until then, we will catch you next time. Yes, Over 50 Club. Love over, you guys. Over 50 Club. All right, bye guys. See you next week. Bye.